Hi, welcome back. Now, when you're running trading systems on MT4 that is running on a VPS, right? The one most irritating and even dangerous thing that can happen to you is that sometimes your VPS will auto reboot by itself. It could be a memory crash, it could be an update to Windows, it, it could be anything. Now, what happens is if, let's say, if the VPS auto restarts by itself, right? What happens is that your MT4 platforms does not start up on its own and your trading system is now not running when you require it to be running it for 24 7 all right so it can be quite scary when the first time when you log into your vps and all you see is the blue desktop and nothing else all right so i'm going to show you how you can allow your vps to keep your mt4 running at all times even after a reboot all right the first thing first Okay, you need to download a certain file, so I'll just uh, open up the Internet Explorer. Okay, go to our website. Just go to Guiding Star Technologies. Dot com. All right, within the site itself, just click on Support and FAQ. So just click on this. Alright, so just scroll down until you get to the section where we talk about this, this auto starting up your MT4 platform. Alright, so how to automatically start your MT4 platforms when VPS reboots unexpectedly. So expand that. This is actually from originating from an article under tradingfxvps.com. Alright, so you can just click on this link. It will automatically link you to tradingfxvps.com but let me just click on this link here to download this file that you need to auto log in into your vps all right so just click on it <clears throat> and it will ask you whether you want to run or save this file so just click uh, save or save as for me i'll just do a save as and i'll save it under my download folder Alright, you just say that if there's any error messages that comes out, just uh, ignore them, it's fine. Now, let me just go over to my download folder. Alright, so this is the file that I've just downloaded. Okay, just double click on it. And just click on run. Okay, right here, right, it's asking you for the password to your VPS. So what this software does is that it will automatically log in to your VPS for you if your VPS reboots itself. Alright, so let me just key in the password for this. Alright, so I've already keyed in the password and now it will automatically lock it into my VPS when it reboots. Now, before you try to do a reboot, I want you to do another step right now. So, you need to actually put the files that you want to run into your startup folder itself. Alright, so how do you do that? Okay, first you need to go to your startup folder. So, click on the start. And under this search programs and files, I want you to, to type in shell colon common space startup exactly like this all right shell colon common space startup all right click on enter all right so this gets you to this startup folder itself okay right now it's actually empty so whatever you place inside here you automatically run by itself when this VPS starts. So let me just go over and open another window explorer window here and okay, let me just dock it over here. Okay and on this second window I'll go to where I can find my MD4 installations. Now I only want 
two instances to run automatically for this setup. So I'll just open this folder here. Okay, this is the first instance of MD4 that I want to run. So I'll select this terminal application, but I'll do a right click and create shortcut. All right, so there is a shortcut that's created here. Rename this shortcut to something that is meaningful to you. So I'll put in IGMT4 1. All right, and I'll drag this over to this folder here. All right, you see that? So this is the first one. Now go back to program files x86, go to the second folder. Okay, I also want this MT4 to be run. So same thing, terminal application, I'll do a right click, create shortcut. Okay, this is the shortcut that we are now creating. Rename it. Give it a different name and drag this file over to the startup folder. All right, so I have two shortcuts here that will automatically be fired up when this runs. All right, so you can see that this is the startup folder here. All right, so you're done. Okay, let me just close this box. Okay, let me just also drag this down and close this. Close this up. Okay, right now what I'll do is that I will do an automatic reboot of the uh, VPS. So I will just click on restart. And they'll ask, you, they'll ask me whether is this plan. Yes, this is actually plan. I just command that this is to reboot VPS. All right, so just click on OK. And there you have it. So right now the VPS is going to be restarting. So what you what you want to what you want to see is that once this is uh, being rebooted, you also be kicked out of your VPS. All right, and just get out first, and then wait about say three to five minutes. And try to log in back into your VPS, and you should see the two instances of MD4 now running on your VPS. All right, so there you have it. This is how you can allow auto recovery to happen on your VPS. Thanks for watching.